furlongs, they're often racing. Frank will slow away, has dwelt and just required pushing into the bridle for the early stages, and as such, He's lost the bullet train at the front, who's having a look round Ian Wongan to see where Frankel is, and now Tom Queeley faces a dilemma. Having slept in the stalls, how close does he move at this early stage? Cyrus Zegler goes forward, bullet train clearly being restrained in an attempt to try and get Frankel on his back. His rider looking round persistently. Nathaniel is in third place with Master of Hounds. A little bit of early drama with uh, Frankel in fifth place, sleeping coming out of the stalls, and Pastorius is last of the six. So Cyrus de Zegler with Nathaniel now pushing on into second place. Bullet Train trying to get in front of Frankel in third and fourth place, but unable to slipstream him. He's following Nathaniel instead. In fifth place is Master of Hounds, and Pastorius is last of the six. So Cyrus de Zegler up the side of the course leads Bullet Train just trying to make himself a nuisance up the inside once more and trying to move to the rails. In third place is Nathaniel. Frankel keeping his powder dry riding rather than chasing the pace, which has been picked up by Bullet Train eyeballing Cyrus de Zegler as they make their way up inside the final five. Nathaniel in third, Frankel in fourth, then Master of Hounds, and at the rear of the field is Pastorius. So out in front, Bullet Train leading and pressing on by a length or so now with half a mile to travel. From in second place, Cyrus de Zegler. Nathaniel Daniel is in third place. Frankel is in fourth with the pink cap and trying to move forward now into a challenging position. Master of Hounds and Pastorius as they move through with three furlongs to travel. Cyrus de Zegler corners in front from Nathaniel. Frankel pulls towards the outside. The pink cap, Tom Queeley, beginning to try and close down. Cyrus de Zegler from Nathaniel. Frankel keeping closer, still being held together by Tom Queeley. Cyrus de Zegler, Frankel moves alongside. Queeley's finger poised on the button for one final electric burst. Frankel bidding to settle it. Cyrus de Zegler is making a fight of it on the far side. Frankel extends. Cyrus de Zegler is a worthy adversary, but up towards the line. All comers, all grounds, all beaten. Frankel won the champion stakes and lives up to the title. Cyrus de Zegler in second. Nathaniel is third. In fourth with Pastorius. Master of Hounds and last of all bullet train. Salute a racing great. The embodiment of equine perfection bows out on a perfect high. Frankel takes his 14th consecutive race, the Kipco Champion Stakes. Cyrus de Zegler, one of the best horses in the world and one of the very best on soft ground, has asked him a little more than other adversaries have done. But Tom Queeley, who knows and loves this beautiful horse so well, has ridden him with the coolness, the assurance, the confidence that he always has. And those who assert that Frankel might have been really tested today need only look at the time it's taken Quilly to pull him up to know that his victory only tells you half the story. We have still.